Yo guys, today I'm going to show you how to add a, add a Saber Glow effect to your Valorant montages, just to make you know, just to make some stuff look pretty cool and stand out. So first, you know, you're going to need to download Saber. So top link in the description, just click that, take you straight to the website, download Saber. Then once you've installed that, you load up After Effects, you get your clip. Now I, I've just got some random clip here, and I'm going to find where I want it. I just I just want it where I hold the gun. So I'll get rid of that. So I've got my clip. Now what you want to do is just right click on your clip and click pre-compose. And this will come up, just click OK. And it will then change the colour of this. If you double click on this, it opens up like a new composition, which is just for this. You see it. So my, my clip's over here. So I'm only working with this bit. So to start off with, make, make sure you're selected on the clip. Bring out the pen tool and just... Zoom in, move this around, and pen around the gun. It doesn't have to be very accurate because the saber effects are fairly big, and you won't actually notice, you know, if it's slightly away from the gun. I'm just going to do this quick, just you know, so it's a quick tutorial, and you're not sat here for twenty minutes while I explain everything slowly. Just make make sure it goes relatively around the gun very well. Yeah, I'm not going to do the gun buddy, but you can. And then once it's done that, don't don't connect it at the end because it will cut it out. But then what you need to do, right click over here, new and a solid. You know, uh, if it's in a montage, just make it easy for you. Name it Saber. I'm just going to leave it as black solid. And then you get your Saber effect. It'll be under video copilot. Just drop it onto this. And then come to your Valorant, come to your mask. Oh, don't change the color. Click Control C to copy it. And then Control V to paste it onto it. So you can see the mask is now on here. And you render settings for your Saber and your Black Solid. Change this to Transparent. And your Customize. Change this to Layer Mask. So now you can see it's gone around that. And you can change, you know, it comes with all these presets. So you've got like Fire. You can see the fire around the gun. And one little trick to make it stand out, if you click if you actually click, you know, on your clip, press T to bring up opacity, put it to about 50%, it you know, it really makes the saber effect stand out and pop. So that's just a cool little trick. And then if you want it to like travel around the gun the way I've the way I've done it in a montage, uh if you want it to travel from the left side, start you know, put the keyframe in and put the start offset 100%. And then where you want it to fully be on, you put it to 100%. So you can see it slowly goes around the gun. And if you want it to do the other way around, it's the end offset. You start at 100, so you bring it down. You know, or you can start it at zero and it comes around this way. And it's just a nice little effect. And just make stuff pop out. Um, I'll show you what it looks like hit right now. Okay, guys, that's all for the saber saber effect on After Effects. Let me know if you enjoyed the video. Let me know what you want to know. No next, and I'll see you in the next video.